What's up, motherfuckers? What the fuck is going on? What's really going on, mother suckers? What the fuck is up? Um, first of all, bitch, you know the drill. I want to thank people, um, everybody, you know, that's been subscribing to my shit. You know, you fucks with me, I fucks with you. You rock with me, guess what, bitch? Uh -huh. I rock with you, motherfuckers. So, <sighs> I want to talk about this. And I know motherfuckers gonna be like, oh, you're always talking about race. You're always talking about racism. You're always, you know, trying to get subjects or you get views. You want attention, you want clout. But no, motherfuckers, like, the, the things I say, they come to me, you know. I, when it all started, you know, when I wanted to make a video why uh, Mexicans don't get along with Salvadoreños or Guatemaltecos or whatever. So I asked my mom. And Mario was there. We were going to eat to Olive Garden. My mom was there. Mario was there. I was like, hey, mom, um, so tell me why, according to your opinion, do you think that Mexicans don't get along with Salvadoreños? And I was very specific. I was, I said Salvadoreños. And she's like, mm -mm, nope. Los Salvadoreños son bien malos. She told me that Salvadoreños were really evil or mean. Malos means like bad. And I was like, oh, tell me more, mother. Because I really like to know the opinions of my mother because to me, she tells me, like she just says it. Like if it's bad or right or wrong or whatever, she just fucking says it. And then she's like, and let me tell you why, okay? Um, One of her godparents her godmother from la secundaria i guess when you go to school in mexico you get like a godparent una madrina and um she was her madrina for her quinceanera too was killed by a salvadoreño that she was with this she didn't my mom didn't even tell me how the fuck it happened what are those little things flying around are those little angels um she, my mom just told me this. She's like, yeah, he, he told her, if you're not going to be with me, you're not going to be with anybody. And that was it. That's all my mom told me. And she's like, he killed her and he ran away to El Salvador. And this is what the whole family told her. Don't fuck with them Salvadoreños. Don't fuck with the Salvadoreños. She didn't listen. And now she's dead. And I was like, what the fuck? Like, I didn't, my mom didn't know the whole story. And I didn't want to talk about this because I didn't know the whole story. So then time passed, um, my sister Sweet 16 was on the 21st of September. So the whole motherfucking family came from fucking Texas, from Pennsylvania, from Arizona. Everybody in the motherfucking mama was at my sister Sweet 16. So then my cousin came over, you know, we, I love my cousin Jay. He is from Dallas. He is a Dallas motherfucking fan. He has a big head. He has a big heart. You know, he's he's like a storyteller. And he fucks with everybody. That motherfucker has been to Brazil. That motherfucker has been to... He was born in California, but he moved to... um He moved to Dallas when he was little. But he just loves every fucking culture. Like, he's like, Erica, I want to go do this. And he went to Miami. He fucked with the Puerto Ricans. He fucks with the... the he fucks with everybody, you know? I, and that's why I like him because he's very he's very sociable like me. He's one of the few people that I fucking... That's related to me that I really, really fuck with. But anyways, bitch. Um, so we were, like, chilling. And he's like... I was telling him, so what do you think about Salvadoreños? And then, you know me, I'm like weird. I like to know about shit. So, he started telling me, well, you know, my tia got killed by a Salvadoreño. And I was like, uh, is it the same lady that my mom is talking about? That my mom told me, my mom told me something, a little something about that. But she didn't tell me the whole story. And he's like, yeah, she is my tia. She's my aunt. And she, um, she used to babysit me. And I was like, oh my God. Are you gonna tell me the whole motherfucking story? My my face was like, oh hell no, I'm gonna learn all about this today. Now finally, after all this time, because my mom she says stories, but she doesn't say it all the way through. Like she just says whatever she remembers or whatever they tell her. But this lady that got killed by a Salvadoreño, that's a family, his family with my cousin, but his godmothers with my mom. That's my mom's godmothers. Okay, 
So what he told me is that this lady was married to a Mexican. But the Mexican, in Dallas, in Dallas, Texas, it was a Mexican lady and a Mexican man. So the um, the Mexican guy, they guess they live in Dallas, Texas, and he fucking got shot by some gangsters, some um, uh, black guys, according to my cousin, in Dallas. Because it's really ghetto where, I guess, where they were, it's like a hood, it's like uh, majority uh, Mexicans and blacks. And I don't know what the fuck happened, but... um. He got shot and he got killed. So then the lady started dating a Salvadoreño. And the whole family was against it. They're like, no, Salvadoreños are not no good for you. Da -da 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 -da, whoop -whoop -whoop. And the lady didn't listen. She kept dating him. So she got pregnant. So when she, after she got pregnant, I guess she started seeing that he was like so jealous. He was controlling. And she's like, fuck all that. I don't want to be with you no more. And I guess he couldn't take it. He was like, uh, you're going to be with me, bitch. So my cousin said that he took her out to eat. So he took her out to eat. They went to eat. And I guess they lived in some apartments. And as she was going upstairs, she she didn't even know who, she, who shot her. She was going upstairs. He went, pat, pat, shot her. And there she went, dead. And they never found the motherfucker. And to me, I think that he went back to El Salvador. And they never found her. But then guess what? there was a child a little girl and i guess i've met this little girl because i've gone to texas uh, i've gone to dallas before like a couple years ago and my cousin took me to this house and he's like that's my cousin da, 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 da. but this girl the daughter does not have a father because the father ran away right to el salvador and his and his her father killed his mother her mother so her mother's dead so this girl is being raised by her tia, the sister of the of her mother, which is me she's Mexican. So she's being raised raised by her. Now the girl's like grown. I guess she's like graduated from high school. I don't know. But a couple of years ago, they wanted to make her quinceañera, right? They wanted to make her quinceañera. And so when you know when you're gonna make a quinceañera, you tell all of the family, everybody, like, oh yeah, I want to make a quinceañera. You know, you just want to you know pitch in. Da -da 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 -da. So the sister of the sister was against it. She was against making a quinceañera for her own family, for her own blood, because she said, I'm not making no quinceañera for no fucking salvi. She hates Salvadoreños so motherfucking much that even though that is her family, that, that little that girl, her that she doesn't have a dad or a mom, she still comes up, oh, I'm not going to make no fucking quinceañera because she's a salvi. She is half Mexican, okay? She, well, she's American. She's American because she was born in America. But she, her father is Salvadoreño, and her mother is Mexican. But the fact, because she has Salvadoreño blood in her, because they hate the man so much for killing the sister, they don't want to fuck with her. That's the most, most ignorant shit I ever heard in my motherfucking life. Bro, how can they even do that to their sister? Their sister is dead. She wants to see her daughter having a fucking quinceañera. Like, wherever she is in heaven, whatever. Like, so fucking ignorant. And then, whatever happened over there came through over here. So, my mom's over here saying, oh, yeah, Salvi's are crazy for a mistake that one motherfucker made. One motherfucker made. That stupid motherfucker that killed his girl, the woman. And now, because of that, it has, like, como se dice span and express spread and like a lot of i heard like my family members they don't fuck with salvadorinos because of what that motherfucker did like that's crazy to me this is crazy like and then i don't know but there's a lot of people like this there's a lot of people like this that oh i'm all about family da -da 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 -da, -da -woo -woo, but then come up with some bullshit like this i don't know i just think this this story was crazy but anyways <laughs> This is my little story, bitch. Um, to all my bird gang, 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 gang motherfuckers. I love you. Peace.